हेलो व्यूवर्स वेलकम टू माय चैनल कुक की प्रीना इट्स ऑलवेज अ प्लेजर टू वेलकम माय रेगुलर विजिटर्स एंड वेरी वॉर्म वेलकम टू माय न्यू विजिटर्स कुक की प्रीना इज अ वन स्टॉप डेस्टिनेशन वेर यू कैन फाइंड वेराइटीज ऑफ रेसिपीज अक्रॉस इंडिया एंड सम ग्लोबल क्विजीन्स ऑल्सो सो प्लीज डू विजिट माई चैनल गो थ्रू द वीडियोज and it these are very easy to do recipes you can easily adopt it i'm sure you will love the recipes and after watching the videos please like share and leave your comments also and please 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 do subscribe my channel cook with lena and you will find you will find many interesting things over here so uh, viewers it's a lovely day and uh, i am going to do something interesting so let's get started here is the popsicle isn't it gorgeous learn to make it hello viewers welcome to my channel cook with reena as you can see these are wow small pieces of kulfis and these are so gorgeous isn't it these are jamun kulfi you can say indian blackberry kulfi it's very very delicious sweet and sour and some masaledar you will love it so please follow my channel uh, cook with reena to learn how to cook this how to make this and enjoy this luscious jamun kulfi please come and join me i'm just going to make it with fresh jamun please do join hello viewers it's morning hours and birds are chirping everywhere and i'm having these beauties on this table and this is i'm finding the perfect time to make something with these beauties they are yes they are indian blackberries jamun kale kale jamun so first of all it it's important how to select the jam the fruit see it should be fleshy and not pulpy it should be ripe but firm you have to select like this we should transfer the jamun in the cooking pan and add half cup water and we shall cook it covered till the jamun becomes soft uh, i have cooked the jamun and they are soft now now i have to wait till it is cool and then i'll take out the pulp out of it for the popsicles or uh whatever you want to make you have to cook it first then cool it and take out the pulp and discard the seeds so these uh, berries when I mean, jamuns are cold now they have cooled down now what we have to do we have to separate out the seeds from it we shall separate the seeds and we'll do with the pulp only so slowly either you use your finger or with your spoon and fork you separate it and then we shall do our next step so i have separated the seeds and but i need to pulse it to make it give it a smooth texture for any popsicle ice cream or kulfi we need a smooth texture so i shall pulse it and you know these seeds they have lot of things although i have taken the main flesh but still i think there is some flavor left in it so i'll soak it in some water and try to make some uh, mocktail or some sherbet with this so shall come back after pulsing it see i have pulsed it It has become so smooth. 
Now uh, it's time to add the sugar, sweetener. So as you, as we were, uh, uh, you must be watching my videos, and you must have seen that I never use refined sugar in any of my sweet dishes. So here also, I will use unrefined sugar. That is, we call it Kansari sugar or desi khand. I this is seven seven fifty grams of uh, jamun was there. And after taking out the seeds, it must be not less, a lot more than 500 grams. So in that, I am using 70 grams of sugar. So if I find it less sweet, then I'll add later. Uh, because I am making for the first time with this Kansari sugar. Uh, so I will, I have to check it. And you know, in some bit of salt is always required to add in any of the dessert to balance the taste. So here is my salt and now I am adding the sugar. You know, after uh, one boil I come to know whether it is sweet or not, it, may, it needs more sweet, accordingly I will add it. Sugar is melted but what I find I need to add little more so it comes to 100 grams, total 100 grams of Kansari sugar I used. This will be enough. And let it, let it come to boil, then I'll cool it again and then I'll put in the popsicle. It's done. I have checked the sugar, it's absolutely fine. And now I'll switch off the this oven and let it cool. Then I shall put it in the mold, popsicle mold. So this is cooled down completely. Now it's time to put it in the mold. Before putting it in the mold, I'll add a very flavored spice in this. This will add kick to the kulfi. You know, this kulfi is light, sweet and little sour taste with some masala flavor. So in for that I have added jeera, I mean cumin, toasted cumin and with little bit of um, red chili flakes. And you make it, you will know what does it mean and it will be served with black salt. So let me put it in the mold now. If you have kulfi mold, you can put it in that. You can uh, freeze it in your uh, freezer ice box with some stick to it. It will make mini mini popsicles. So I am making few in this and fill few I will fill in the ice box with small small sticks. Now it is ready to go into the deep fridge for freezing. Uh, it will require at least 6 to 8 hours because it is monsoon season it takes some more time. So see you after it freezes. I have filled this ice box also. Now I will cover it with this silver foil. And this will also go into the freezer. And you know it becomes very easy to serve this small pieces with some dry masalas. Just like kulfi. So see, see you after it freezes. So now viewers. It's time to unfold this 
Wow, tempting popsicles which I made with jamu and these I had put in the ice box to make small small dices of this kulfi and which can be enjoyed with black salt and all masalas. So let's see what's the you know uh, you have to uh, take out the uh, this kulfi and you have to keep it in room temperature at least for 10-15 minutes then it will be easier to take out. It will come because let me wait for a few minutes then I shall come back. It's already loose. I think it will come out easily. Ah, just see. Wow, so interesting it is. You can see. Lovely. And this though you can just take out like you take out the um, uh, uh, ice cubes. Wow. Isn't it gorgeous? So interesting. So viewers, you can now uh, easily make your popsicles and kulfi, whatever you say and enjoy at your home. And you won't get these taste in market bought. And definitely not in Delhi's, old Delhi's uh, kulfi walas also. Because it is all pure and made it with lots of love in very hygienic way. So please do try this and come back to me how it worked. And please do not forget to like, uh, click on the like button. And please do subscribe my channel. Thank you so much for watching. So here I have served. Now you just sprinkle some black salt over it. And if you want some uh, chili flakes also or, or roasted jeera will also do wonders. So viewers, here's the jamun kulfi. Wow, the flavor I'm getting, I cannot explain you. So do try this and please show some love and like my channel and subscribe. Thank you so much.